Bonnie, I am back. Happy Saturday evening. I am so excited because I am burning one of my top seven fall candles. I've got the house filled with Cider Lane. This is one of the brand new Luminary candles from Bath & Body Works. It's a wraparound, absolutely gorgeous jar. And as usual, Cider Lane does not disappoint. I've been burning this one for probably a good two hours now. Everyone in the house is enjoying it. The notes on this one are warm caramel, granny smith apple, and ground clove. What I love about Cider Lane, it smells amazing cold too. It's not too spicy, it's not too sweet, and it's not too fruity. It's like the perfect combination of all three of those scents. And I know a lot of you have been asking where is caramel apple this year? So this year we did not get a caramel apple. This is, I think, one of the online exclusives last year. Caramel apple is Granny Smith apple, warm golden caramel, and cinnamon vanilla cream. Cider Lane, I think, is almost, almost the same, but not quite. <laughs> so there actually are some differences. Um, caramel apple is a lot more, it's a lot sweeter. So if you like caramel apple, but this one is a little bit too sweet for you, you're gonna love Cider Lane even more. They're definitely siblings. They're not even cousins, they are siblings. Um, caramel apple, definitely, I think I've said this before, smells like a carnival. You know, like when you walk into like a county fair and you can smell the caramel apples? That's what caramel apple smells like, exactly like when they've got all those caramel apples laid out in front of you and you really want one because they smell so good. <laughs> Cider Lane, I think, is a more sophisticated scent. Cider Lane is a little bit more apple, and I do smell that tiny bit of clove. Now, I know a lot of people are a little bit scared off sometimes by clove because clove can be an overpowering scent. It is not overpowering in Cider Lane, especially when it's burning. When it's burning, you get a really nice layer of those fruity apples, the warm caramel, but not too sweet, and then a pinch, literally a pinch of the ground clove just to make it a little bit like more fall. So it's not overpowering at all. It's a really smooth, relaxing scent absolutely one of my all-time fall favorites and this one is burning really well i've probably got over an inch on the wax pool here clean burn and um the, the throw is really strong on this one i would say it's a high medium um it's not as strong as oh there goes coco <laughs> it's funny now that i've moved to this other room you can kind of hear coco barking in the distance but she's not as like <laughs> as loud <laughs> Um, this, this candle is not as strong as, say, your pumpkin bonfire or, let me grab this one, um, like your Edcorn Lane. These candles are, like, I'm actually going to do a video of, like, the seven strongest fall candles that Bath & Body Works has. I did order today, um, a couple more from this collection. Um, what did I get? Which, what is that one? Let me, let me, let me look real quick, you guys. Um, cause I did get one of these. I wanted to get the, um, I took advantage of the free shipping on 50 and, um, and then and I got, oh, I got fresh fall morning. That's a really strong one. Apple weather is really strong. Eggcorn lane, really, really strong. So if those are too overpowering for you, but you still like that really nice fall scent, um, I definitely recommend Cider Lane. So look how pretty it is in the luminary. Oh my gosh. I need to take a picture of this burning um, outside at night. Absolutely gorgeous. So 10 out of 10 for Cider Lane. Absolutely my favorite for fall. Thank you so much for watching. And um, I think that's it for me tonight. I think I'm going to go watch Star Wars. <laughs> Have an awesome Saturday night. I will see you guys tomorrow. Bye-bye.